In this video, we're going to fix row blocks no longer responding to a click, not working. Basically, you just keep clicking on the uh, row blocks icon and it just will not launch. So let's go ahead and troubleshoot fixing it. I'm going to give you a few methods, but I'm pretty confident that I should be able to get you up and running. If you haven't restarted your computer yet, your whatever desktop or computer, Windows 10, 11, whatever, make sure you restart the computer and then see if that will work and solve the issue. Next, I want you to locate the icon on your desktop, your Roblox icon. And what you want to do is you're going to right click on it. And then from there, what you're going to do is left click properties. And then what you're going to do from here is you're going to run compatibility troubleshooter first. So what you're going to do is do that under compatibility, which is on the bottom right here of these little tags. Click Run Compatibility Troubleshooter, and then that should take a few minutes to do. And then see if that will get you into Roblox. Next, what I want you to do is run this program as an administrator. So go ahead and click on it. Click Apply, and then OK. And then see if you're able to get on into Roblox. Next, what I want you to do is Try to update the uh, writing program that it's used. Now, a lot of software, a lot of games use Java. Actually, Roblox uses a, a program called Inu, I-N-U. So if you can go on the very bottom left here and type in Inu, I-N-U, see if you can locate it here, right-click it, and see if you can do an update on, the, uh, on Inu. And then restart the computer, and then see if that will get you up and running. Next, what I want you to do is check for updates in Windows. So on the very bottom left of Windows 10 and 11, you're just going to type in update. If it's Windows 7 or below that, you just go into the Microsoft icon, go to the magnifying glass, click update, and then you may have some updates left. Go ahead and do them and then restart the computer and see if you're able to get into Roblox. Next, what I want you to do is update the video driver. And so to do that, again, just go to the bottom left here and type in device manager. And then that'll pop up up here. Click on Device Manager. So basically what you want to do is go to the driver and update the graphic driver. And then look for Display Adapter, which is right here. Click on it. And this specific computer uses an NVIDIA, but it doesn't matter. It could be a Intel. It could be an AMD. Whatever you have, click on it and then choose Update Driver. Okay, and then once you did that, I want you to go back to the icon on your desktop, the Roblox icon, right click it again go to properties left click properties and then go to compatibility again and then from there what I want you to do is click compatibility mode run this program in compatibility mode 4 click on it and go and choose Windows Vista and I understand that you're probably not using Windows Vista which is completely fine so click Windows Vista and then what you're going to do is click apply and then click OK and then tell me if you're able to get into uh, Roblox. If you're able to get in, then you can go back in there and change that back to Windows 10 or whatever Windows that you have. Okay, next, after you've tried that, what I want you to do is you're going to have to uninstall Roblox and reinstall it. So to do that, you just type in Programs on the bottom left of your computer screen. And then you want to go up to Add or Remove Programs. Go ahead and click it. And you'll find Roblox. Usually just categorize all your apps and features by size. Roblox will be on the very top or close to the top. And what you're going to do is click on it, uninstall, and then reinstall Roblox. And then tell me if you're able to get in, which I'm sure you will after you reinstall the game. All right, thank you for watching, and make sure you subscribe to my channel.